Now today I'm not going to review crochet braids. I'm actually going to review the hair that I'm wearing now that I got from Eunice Hair. Now I'm going to try to answer all of the questions that at least I have when I am searching for human hair, what's going to be good quality, what's going to be worth my money. Um, but before we get into the video, make sure you join the crew by hitting that subscribe button and also follow me on social media so you can see what I'm up to when I'm not on YouTube. So I purchased these bundles from Eunice Hair. It is their Peruvian Jerry Curl. And I got three bundles in 18, 20, and 22 inches with a 16 inch closure. And this is how long the hair comes down on me. So right below the boobs, and I'll show you in the back too. So that's how far that 22 inch comes down in the back. Now in hindsight, I wish I had gotten an 18 inch closure so my closure and my shortest bundle would be the same length. That way you have the option of cutting in layers as you see fit because this 16 inch just isn't blending as well to me. Um, I wish it was a little bit longer but overall it's working and I love this hair and I love this, this, this look. So uh, next time I'll just make sure my closure and my shortest bundle is the same length. Now the closure already came pre-plugged which is nice but I did go in and plug it a little bit more just to thin out the hairline make it a look, look a little more natural and I widened the part so I tweezed that out a little bit too I didn't fool with um, bleaching the knots and it looks really natural to me um, I didn't even put any powder on it this morning any pressed powder and I think the part looks pretty natural without the bleaching now I always go with the closure because even though I love frontals they are a lot of freaking work and you have to know how to install saw a frontal correctly or it's just not going to look right. So just washing your face every morning, you're going to have to figure out how to get that frontal to lay back flat. So it's a lot of maintenance with the frontal. So I always get a four by four closure uh, because that gives me the option of either wearing a side part or a center part. But you guys know me, I love my side part. So this is the way that I normally wear it. So this is not a sew-in. I actually make wigs with all of my bundles because sew-ins take a lot of time and with the wig, you do the work once and you can wear it anytime you want and you guys know I love my crochet braids but um, I always like to have a really nice human hair wig on hand for those times when I'm in between crochet installations I can grab me a wig walk out of the house still look fit and fabulous you know we need to have options right so yeah this is a wig and I made it about a week ago and I've been wearing it every day since now I don't sleep in my wigs I take them off at night and I reinstall them in the morning I just use a little bit of got to be glue right around the hairline for um, the, the closure and for the hair itself I just spritz it with some water and apply some spray leave-in conditioner if I think it needs it um, and that's all of the maintenance that I have to do with this hair and the hair really held up well and it really looked amazing all week now last night uh, because I've been wearing the wig for a week I went ahead and co-washed it and then I applied uh, a leave-in conditioner now the leave-in that I use is the my L leave-in conditioner this is a part of their pomegranate and honey line and I really love this leave-in it smells amazing and I use it on my natural hair and this hair responded really really well uh, to the products after the leave-in I did seal it all in with uh, Garnier Fructis Sleek and Shine Anti-Frizz Serum just to give the hair some shine and make it pop and uh, this is how it looks the day after I wash the hair and you can see the curls pop right back and it looks really shiny and healthy. Another thing I love about this hair is that it does not tangle and mat at all. Even at the nape of the neck where you normally experience a lot of matting with curly hair, this hair does not tangle and mat. <clears throat> it wears really well. I didn't have to detangle this hair the entire week that I wore it. Now last night when I washed the hair, I did run my demon brush through with the conditioner in just to loosen up the curls and get them to kind of pop right back into shape. Uh, but that was the only time I had to detangle the hair the whole week that I was wearing it. And this hair also doesn't give you a lot of shedding. Um, I did get some shedding, of course, when I detangled the hair. So you're gonna get a little bit of shedding because it is curly hair, but nothing that you have to be concerned about. 
So overall, I'm really enjoying this hair. I think it's very high quality, especially at this price point. I paid about $187 for the lengths that I chose. So this hair is super affordable. So if you're on the fence about trying Eunice hair, give it a try. I think you'll be very happy with the quality. So guys, thanks for watching my video and hanging out with me today. I hope the review was helpful. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, stay beautiful, stay blessed, and make sure you stay fit and fabulous. Feeling high, feeling low at the same time. Feel so right, then I'm wrong, hoping I'll be fine. But I get up, I always do.